We're joined by Baltimore County Executive John Olszewski, Jr. Sir, good morning to you. The search and rescue is the key issue. We've heard at least seven people potentially still in the water. Sonar has detected vehicles under the water. What do you know about the efforts right now? Well, we know that since very early this morning, uh, the men and women of the fire departments and agencies of both Baltimore City, Baltimore County, state, other surrounding jurisdictions have been working tirelessly. Uh, our heart goes out to the families impacted by those who were on the bridge, uh, who might have been on the bridge. And really, our, our primary efforts are around search and rescue right now. Um, we have the sun coming up so we can start having our dive teams go in. We're not just doing the surface searches. Um, but we are actively on this scene. Uh, it's been an active scene for many hours already. We expect this to be the case for a long time. Um, this is an absolute tragedy, a uh, shock to all of us. And I uh, just want to thank the first responders who are doing incredible work trying to save and retrieve those who are impacted by this. Um, you know, there's video that we saw just before impact here, and it looked like that the ship was completely dark and there may have been some smoke coming out of it. What are you hearing on your end uh, on what was going on on that ship? Yeah, I mean, and this is information as of now. The best information we have is that the ship, uh, whether for whatever reason, whether it's power or other reason, lost control, ran into the uh, supporting beam of the bridge, which unfortunately caused it to collapse. Uh, again, this is uh, just, we're, we're still reeling through and trying to determine some of the causes. There's uh, an investigation in addition to the active search and rescue happening here um, at this site. So. Um, that we, we know those answers will come forward, uh, um, but it's an absolute tragedy. Our efforts are focused on the search and rescue right now as we try to determine both next steps uh, for, for traffic, for commerce. But really right now, our, heart, our hearts go out to and our thoughts and prayers are with those uh, individuals and families who are Indeed. affected by this collapse. Indeed. All right. Thank you so much, Baltimore County Executive John Olszewski. John, thank you so much. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.